Increase heat they were talking about. And obviously, a good reminder, folks, this is just the start of summer. So <laughs> right. we've June. got a long way to go, my friends. Oh, man. Yeah, what? It's just June. Uh, it's right? just June. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We have to go through July, August. Oh, How about goodness. that? And September. <laughs> yeah. I'm going home. Uh, well, look, well, take me with you, all right? <laughs> <laughs> right? Heat advisory. Okay, we have it for tomorrow through at least 6 o'clock in the evening as opposed to 7. I'm not sure why the National Weather Service did that, but just let me tell you. It's going to be hot. It's going to be humid as we go through the day tomorrow, and you'll see that we have a heat advisory there, and we'll likely have that 106 feels like temperature, maybe up to 107, 108 as we go to the afternoon. We head into your Saturday. It will likely feel like 104, a little drier air starts starting to move in and then going into Sunday still hot out there. So don't let it fool you with well, it feels like temperature about 103. The hour by hour forecast tomorrow 81 at 7. How about those lunchtime temperatures near 100 degrees at 1 and you'll see the high temperatures about 104. But again, feeling much hotter. So let's take a lot of breaks, drink plenty of water. There's still an ozone action day for tomorrow and we're going to have more of these through the summer. But if you have problems breathing there, maybe some asthma problems, make sure you limit your time outdoors. Now the good thing about it is that we do have a cold front on the way and that will knock our temperatures down a bit. You'll likely notice it a bit more into Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday of next week. That front will also bring an opportunity for some showers, but we're not talking about a complete weekend washout. Some of this wet weather you'll see with Futurecast here will move in from the north and then slide into the area as we go through your Sunday afternoon and even into Monday. There could be some areas, especially farther to the south of I-20 that could see a a better drink of water. Right now we got the rain chance on Sunday at 10%, 20% into your Monday. Your first alert seven day forecast shows temperatures that eventually will go down. But for the next few days here, we're talking about triple digit heat. So again, drink plenty of water and take those breaks. 100 degrees for high temperatures on your Sunday. And then you're going to notice a stretch of 90s. That's not bad. Uh, man, I do get a little chill. Uh, 92 degrees for your Monday, 93 for Tuesday, and about 95 for Wednesday. Whoa, right? Need a little he, jacket. He, he's telling jokes. <laughs> yeah. Talk about 90s and saying a little chill. <laughs> right. All right, Dimitris. Thank you, Dimitris.